Hey guys, welcome back to another Clash Royale video, and today we're we'll taking a look at a new and improved version of a Mini P.E.K.K.A. Royal Hog Fast Cycle deck. Right here, it's a 3.0 Elixir Cycle. You have the Firecracker taking the place of the Magic Archer from the previous meta version last season. The Firecracker is extremely annoying if you don't have a response for it, and you have the ability with this deck, with that Fast Cycle, to stack multiple Firecrackers in the arena if your opponent doesn't have a response getting ultimate value. You have the Earthwork in there, guys. Pretty important in the current meta for dealing with all the buildings and all the spawners. Heal Spirit obviously does so well with the Royal Hogs. And the Hunter, surprisingly, is very, very strong in the current meta because it has the ability to be a high damage unit up front for things like Balloons, Giants, or Golems. But it's more versatile because you also have the ability to deal splash damage at range for things like Skeleton Barrels. So overall, very, very effective deck, guys. Once again, if you want to support me, feel free to throw in Creative Coach Chain into the bottom of shop before buying past Real or special offers or gems. It costs you nothing extra and is a great way to help support the channel and help support me. So thank you if you are rocking Coach Chain in your shop. All right, let's go ahead and you guys jump into our first battle of the evening and see how we can do against our dear friend Abokto. Now, as you guys might have noticed, we have a fresh new overlay on the channel. Just had it professionally made uh, today. So I'm really interested to see what you guys' feedback is on it. Uh, it's very, very different than my traditional one. It is slightly animated. You'll notice a few elements on the overlay that are animated. Um, I tried to make sure that the animation was very minimal and not obtrusive. So any sort of feedback you can offer uh, is greatly appreciated. Do you like it? Do you dislike it? What could be changed or improved? Leave all of your thoughts down below. And uh, yeah. We'll jump into this battle against our dear friend Bokto. Uh, Baby Dragon uh, Barbarian Barrel indicates it's going to be a splash yard deck of some variety. If I had to guess, and hopefully to guess correctly here, we're going to go Piggies and hopefully get our... Oh no, it's going to be a uh, potential uh, Eagle I mean, Healer deck, which I don't know how I feel about. Because right now, if it is... He can go eagle him up here. Yep, there's the eagle one. We're going to pull both of these away with this. Then go hunter here. That'll kill the golem. Nice. Then we're going to go this here. This here. Nice. Let's go. Come on, baby. You got this. So seeing as he likely does not have a fireball in there, we're going to go like this. Get some piglets down here as well. Earthquake this uh, Goblin Hut right here. That heals the piggies up. The pig is going to annihilate. Guys, look at this. The piggies are destroying that tower. Tower is destroyed, man. Tower is destroyed. Poor dude. Poor, poor dude. Now, I want to keep my Ice Golem here because what I want to do right meow is go log here. Mm. You know what? We're trying to distract. We're going to distract and win. I was going to like do some other stuff, but we're kind of just chill here. We're just going to do the chillage instead. Should be fine. Should be fine. Wait for it. One of these. Come on, baby. Nice. What do you got? We killed the Elixir Golem there. He earthquakes my jazz is. We're going to get a uh, mini pack I here for his battle healer. Keep them alive with the uh, heal spirit. Meanwhile, the firecracker just annihilating everything. Oh, man, it's juicy. Because we're absolutely dominating this battle right here. Bokto. Dude. Get absolutely destroyed, my dude. I mean, good game well played. Let's be uh, pleasant here. Good game well played. The game sound team is very loud. Is that just me? Anyways. I'm pretty happy with that battle, guys. We absolutely destroyed there. Never even once felt like we had any threat to our tower. All right, jumping into the next battle over here. Got to dear friend Raku. Good luck, good luck, good luck. I'm hoping we face another one of those decks. That was actually pretty fun. That was pretty fun to see the eagle and get destroyed. Oh no, it's a Zaspel deck. Oh no. Let's do this. Just to make my face a little bit brighter. But yeah, guys, the new overlay I think is pretty cool. I like it. Where'd it go? Ah, this is, this is stupid, guys. This is dumb. Why would I do this so early in the game? He can just go... Uh, he's going to go Sparky. Oh man, we're dead. This deck has nothing for Musketeers, guys. 
We have no fireball, no nothing. He's gonna go mini pack out here for his muskets. We'll keep the mini pack alive with my heal spell. Spell. I was gonna say spirit, and I said spell. Whatever that is. I'll just back here. Just go here. Man, I don't know what to do here, guys. I think that left tower is just dead. Yeah. Left tower is official dead sauce. Man, the firecracker. You could attack any time yesterday if you wanted to. But instead you attack tomorrow, so now we're just dead. This is gonna suck, guys. We have no heavy spell for his musketeers. So I predict, like, just getting anything done is gonna be very difficult. Honestly. I foresee this being a very annoying and difficult battle here, boys. Oh, man. Yeah. Dudes. I actually 100% actually think we're dead. 100%. Okay. I still 1,000% think we're dead. 1,000%. Let's go. Okay. I still 99% think we're dead. It's gone down. Mm. The deadliness here is slowly but surely going down. Okay. He zaps that. We're going to go aggressive right meow. Just to kind of apply the pressures, which is honestly not the greatest idea. Dude. Shane. What you doing, my dude? Boom. Dude, look at that firecracker! She's in Shane! She's literally insane, guys. Oh, he's that's my cane tower. He's so salty. He's so salty. I, actually, I'd be salty if I were him too, because we just destroyed him. Like, we just destroyed everything. That firecracker is so annoying. I gotta say, the firecracker, I think, is one of the most annoying cards in Clash Royale when you don't have any answer for her. If you don't have arrows in your deck or anything like that, she is such a frustrating card to deal with. But GG's, well played. All right, guys, keeping it going over here. Another quick question regarding the new overlay. Underneath my face cam is the new deck pop-up that showcases the deck we're using. I have two versions of that deck pop-up. One of them has a bit of a glow effect, like animated glow on the corner of it. And one of them has no glow effect. I figured I would use the no glow effect one because it's less distracting. But I'll show you guys both versions right now. And you can give me a just like a, a quick comment as to which version you like better. I could have protected that firecracker if I was smarter. But unfortunately, I lack a brain. So we didn't do that. All right. Yo, seriously, bruh. Man, this is going to suck. Majorly, oh, majorly. He's gonna have a skeleton barrel. Yes. Go firecracker. What does he got a uh, battle ram in there for? I'm confused. I'm confused. Uh, I'm, I'm betting he's got a Mega Knight, which is why I haven't gotten piggies yet. I'm kind of just chilling to see what he's got. I might go ice golem here at the bridge to see what my friend has. He's got Infernal Dragon, Bats, Spear Goblins, Battle Ram. Like, I'm thinking it's one of those Mega Knight bait decks, but we haven't seen a Miner yet. He could just have Battle Ram in place of the Moiner. But then he's got Bandit in there, too. Like, what is this guy doing? Mega Knight here, potentially. But no, no Mega Knights? All right. I still think he's got Mega Knight in his deck, so I'm not going to go Piggies until we kind of figure that out. Right? Told you guys. Let's go. No! My heal spirit, you're too late, you noob sauce. Let's go. Kill that uh, infernal dragon, please. Alright, so I believe I told you guys that he had that. And we were, uh, in fact, correct. So, uh, being correct is always a good feeling. I don't think he's back to Mega Knight just yet. So, we are good to go piggies right here. He's back to Mega Knight. Right meow, though. Yes, yes, yes. This is gonna suck. I think we're dead now, guys. 100%. No, heal spirit, you newbie sauce. Noob, noob, noob. 
Mm. I don't like my corrupted noobs, guys. I really don't like that. Bad. Oh my. I'm such a noob, guys. I wanted to protect the hunter or the, the, the firecracker, but I didn't do anything that I wanted to do right there, guys. I'm sad. One of these. Uh, what the f what okay what what the what the what the what the what what was that whole ice golem jazz right there guys what the what the what I should have protected the firecracker that was on that was I did go firecracker that time guys or ice golem that time that wasn't even me what the what the what is all I gotta say man what the what the what dude bro what the what the what man. I'm actually kind of triggered right now, guys. I'm low-key kind of triggered right now. Because that stupid little interaction there. Let's go. Okay, we good. Firecracker survives. Okay. No, that's supposed to be a... Oh my goodness, I'm so newbie. Dude, that's supposed to be a freaking... Ah... Uh... It's supposed to be an ice golem there, and I went uh, earthquake for some reason. Yeah, we're dead. We're dead. If we win this, I'll be amazed. I'll be amazed if we win this, guys. I don't even know how. Is it possible to win this still? Despite all odds. Despite all freaking odds, can we still win this? Hmm. I doubt it. Let's go. Come on, baby. Hmm. No. Actually. If that log, guys, look at this tower, 78 health. If that log would have connected, we would have won literally 0 0.5 seconds from a win right there. If that log would have connected, we would have won. I think I dropped it as soon as I could. Maybe I could have dropped it a little bit earlier. Man, that was a that was that battle was just a bunch of just uh misplays. But that log was literally this close to hitting his tower. And we ran out of time. If it would have hit, we would have won by tiebreaker. Dude, that feels bad, man. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry for letting you down. I'm sorry, guys. That sucked. I apologize. All right, let's go ahead, guys. Let's jump into another one. We need to recover from that battle. That was honestly embarrassing. We made so many misplays. Just a terrible battle overall. Definitely, definitely winnable. Just nothing good on my end in that battle. This guy's name was insane. How do you do that? Atomic Bomber? How do you get the double name like that? That's so cool. Anyways, um, he likely has a balloon deck as my guess right now. I could be wrong, but... I believe I'm correct. Nice. Oh, Baby Dragon indicates maybe not a uh, balloon deck. What do y'all think? Dude, what's going on with these card drops, bro? What is going on with these card drops? Is it just me? Like, I don't think my internet is that slow. I have a very, very effective internet, guys. I don't think it's that slow. Uh, maybe it is. Maybe I do have slow internet. I don't know. I don't think it is. I, I live stream. I can upload a video to YouTube in three minutes. What in the world? Ay, ay, ay. Alright. Hunter does work there. One more shot, Hunter. Thank you. So I'm just going to go Ice Bird here to get some damage into his tower. Some chip damage. He's got Lumberjack and Mini P.E.K.K.A., which is kind of honestly nasty. Just here. Oh, I can't, I, I can't stop that. But he missed his free spell there, which uh, honestly should be good for us. 
I'll just back here. Come on, let's go. Heals my mini pickup up. Oh, one shot mini pickup. One more shot, please, girl. Thank you. So that wasn't terrible. We got two mini pickup shots with the heal spirit healing it up. Always good when you even heal it up. Bruh. Wait for it. Nice, there we go. It's dead, thank you. Mm. We might be dead though, guys. We should be good though, I think we're good. Good game, bro. It's stressful there, because we can't really defend too many Balloonages. But, the nice little heal spell to the mini Pekka there is pretty cool. I'm happy with that. But anyways guys, that is the end of the video. Here is the deck one more time. If you want to go ahead and give it a shot yourself. 3.0 Fast Cycle Mini Pekka Royal Hogs, guys. Basically an updated version from the previous one and the previous meta. Heal Spirit works so well with those Royal Hogs and honestly with the Mini Pekka as well. There's so many times we'll have Mini Pekka like at one health. Opponent thinks it's dead. Heal Spirit heals it back up to full and it gets like two or three shots to the enemy's tower. So overall guys, a lot of synergy with this deck. Uh, so give it a shot. Let me know how it goes for you. But that is the end of the video. Oh, once again, let me know your thoughts on the new overlay down below in those comments, guys. Uh, I'm really excited for it. I think it looks super cool. So I want to know what you guys think. But that is the end of the video, guys. Thank you for watching and we shall see you in the next one.